Multivision Concurrency Control, is a concurrency control method commonly used by database management systems to provide concurrent access to the database and in programming languages to implement transactional memory. If someone is reading from a database at the same time as someone else is writing to it, it is possible that the reader will see a half-written or inconsistent piece of data. There are several ways of solving this problem, known as concurrency control methods. The simplest way is to make all readers wait until the writer is done, which is known as a lock. This can be very slow, so MVCC takes a different approach, each user connected to the database sees a snapshot of the database at a particular instant in time. Any changes made by a writer will not be seen by other users of the database until the changes have been completed. When an MVCC database needs to update an item of data, it will not overwrite the old data with new data, but instead mark the old data as obsolete and add the newer version elsewhere. Thus there are multiple versions stored, but only one is the latest. This allows readers to access the data that was there when they began reading, even if it was modified or deleted partway through by someone else. It also allows the database to avoid the overhead of filling in holes in memory or disk structures but requires the system to periodically sweep through and delete the old, obsolete data objects. For a document-oriented database it also allows the system to optimize documents by writing entire documents onto contiguous sections of disk or euro. When updated, the entire document can be rewritten rather than bits and pieces cut out or maintained in a linked, non-contiguous database structure. MVCC provides point-in-time consistent views. Read transactions under MVCC typically use a timestamp or transaction ID to determine what state of the DB to read, and read these versions of the data. Read and write transactions are thus isolated from each other without any need for locking. Writes create a newer version, while concurrent reads access the older version. Implementation MVCC uses timestamps and incrementing transaction IDs to achieve transactional consistency. MVCC ensures a transaction never has to wait to read a database object by maintaining several versions of such object. Each version of the object would have both a read timestamp and a write timestamp which lets a transaction read the most recent version of an object which precedes the transaction's read timestamp. If a transaction wants to write to an object, and if there is also another transaction happening to the same object, the read timestamp of must precede the read timestamp of. 